Good morning, fam, and happy hump day Wednesday to you. Once again, this is Dr. Tommy Pringle coming to you again with another work week inspirational and encouraging message for today. This one is fresh off the spiritual press. Many times we can get so caught up on focusing on encouraging other people because of who we are in Christ that we may forget about the importance of making sure that we encourage ourselves as well. It's tough to encourage someone else if you're not encouraged yourself. Their spirit will feed off of your spirit. And if your spirits are low and you don't feel encouraged, it makes it difficult to operate in the fullness of the gifts that God has blessed you with. And instead of being an encourager, you may end up being a discourager. So the Spirit of God inspired me to reflect on this scripture in Deuteronomy in chapter 31. And verse number six, where it reads, be strong and courageous. Do not fear or be in dread of them. For it is the Lord your God who goes before you and with you. He will not leave you or forsake you. Moses was about 120 years old at this time and wasn't able to engage in and participate in battle like he used to. And if you read from the beginning of the scripture, you'll find that the Lord actually told Moses that he will go across the Jordan before him and destroy nations before him so he wouldn't have anything to fear or worry about. Would you need to feel encouraged, trust and know that the Lord will go before you and fight your battles, just as he did for Moses? And in some cases, he'll send someone else on your behalf. And then we're reminded that the Lord will never leave us out to dry for defeat to take place, nor will he forsake us or abandon us in the times of need. So use this to encourage yourself in the Lord and allow that to resonate in your spirit today as the Lord continues to shape and mold you into the Christian that he called you to be. I love you with the love of the Lord. Be blessed this week.